Hey you. Yes you. Why haven't you clicked that subscribe button? Or turn on notifications? You might as well click the like button. Thank you. Your boy's going to be doing a $10 Roblox card giveaway guys. Every single week. If you guys want to have a good chance of winning the giveaway, all you have to do is complete all the steps guys. Alright guys, so make sure you guys leave a like on the video. Click the first link in the description guys. Once you click the first link, make sure you guys click accept invite to join my Tutuski clan. Also make sure you guys join my Smoky Pyro Crew Discord. Click the second link in the description and make sure you guys accept the invite. Once you click the third link in the description, click accept invite to join my Blocks Online Development Server, the game I'm working on. If you guys want to hop on my private server, click the link right next to where it says private server and you can hop on my private server whenever you want. If you guys want to follow me on Instagram, go for it and you're going to have a better chance of winning if you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Hey what's up guys, it's your boy the Southern Winter one back with another video guys and on this video I'm going to be um, showing you the new Sam move that allows you to fly with it which is pretty dope. The move that Garo um, usually, um, usually uses on the anime. So yeah, I didn't get to showcase it on my videos today because my Magna KG reset went from level 1000 to 0. That happened to almost have my KGs because of the beta mode, but to be honest, I'm not really that stressed about it. As long as my like main KGs that I usually use didn't reset, I'm good. They actually did reset, but I leveled them back up, so as long as they don't reset right now, I'm good. So other than that, guys, I'm making this video show you the new sand move and also sh um, show you, um, showcase the, what's it called, the new Scorch KG because on my recent video, I didn't really showcase it properly. So I posted a video on my second channel where Famous Flex was showcasing the Scorch KG and Lightning Mode. So I took a clip from that video where Famous Flex was showcasing the Scorch KG and I'm about to play it right now because I never gave you a proper um, Scorch KG showcase. So yeah, guys, make sure you guys leave a like on this video if you enjoying it so far so i'm going to showcase the scorch kg and then your boy is going to do a battle between the fortune and the lightning mode and then your boy is going to hop on um what's it called the kg customization and try to spin for the scorch kg again guys all right so i'm about to play the clip of famous flex showcasing the scorch kg the full video is on my second channel guys go check it out if you want to and subscribe to my second channel for more content from me and famous flex other than that guys, smash that like button, subscribe and turn on notifications. First we're going to be going over the Scorch release. It's a really good mode that is fire and when combined and you get these Scorch balls behind you and they surround you and stuff like that. They don't do damage if you touch them, but the moves are kind of overpowered. Like the first move is just you throw a Scorch ball at someone and does like 30 or 20 damage. Second move, it just pushes you back and does 20, 20 to 40 damage. The move that you just guys you guys just seen right now, that's the second move. The third move is really overpowered to be honest. The third move is really overpowered and it does a lot of damage and it's spammable. So that's that's bad. Like that's really that's a really bad combination. It's spammable and does a lot of damage. That's a really bad combination. First, it could do about 70 damage and it takes five seconds to use again. So that's a five second cooldown. So after five seconds, you can use it again. And that is really overpowered. Like I'm telling you guys, that is really overpowered because five seconds later, you can just use the move again and do 70 damage and most likely kill person. But a lot of people are saying the Scorch release is bad, quote unquote, because you need aim. That's why I'm saying it's bad because you need aim. And personally, I think the Scorch release is actually really good. In a PvP fight, you're probably gonna, you're probably gonna have to be more offensive and more like you gotta plan your shots and uh like if you find an npc you're probably gonna do way better but let me know what you guys think about the scorch release i'll give it a 7 or 8 out of 10. personally i would use this kick again card because it has range it's spammable and it does a lot of damage most likely it will get nerfed by next week or it will get nerfed in about three or four days but let me know what you guys think about it i like it 